Hey you guys, let's go ahead and jump into it. I've ended the last round and I've started off this uh, next round. What I've done already is get my, my zombies all trained up and you want to get kills uh, inside of the golden circle. Meaning the zombies need to be killed inside of the golden circle. Some people are thinking you have to be in the circle yourself. No, you do not. You just need to make sure you kill zombies that are inside the circle. Uh, you don't have to stand inside of the circle. You could down yourself possibly trying to get killed standing in the circle with them. It's easier just to train up your zombies um, whichever way you feel comfortable based on where your golden circle location may be and get as many kills as needed. I think it's around 10 to 15 uh, zombie kills in the circle when the circle will vanish. Uh, once it vanishes, then you will have a lot of ninjas to fight off. Now, the only problem with doing this without getting tough enough is you need to have really good reflexes and really anticipate where those ninjas are going to uh, pop up. The way that they function is when you sprint, they tend to pop up directly in front of you. So knowing this, you'll, you'll be able to free fire on them if you're running in one direction. Just listen for the poofs, man, because these things could down you. If you get hit twice, you're probably going to go red screen, maybe even down. Uh, I think I go red screen during this fight because there's just so many. Uh, you see, look, that it might have been one or two hits on this red screen. Me. And they're just, they're relentless. But as you do get required kills inside of the Golden Circle, you want to haul ass and get set up to I shoot these danger. zombies. Basically. I even ran out of ammo and had to replenish my UDN ammo in the middle of my fight. Incredible. Uh, but once you kill off the last one, your zombies will spawn in that area as they were the normal zombies. And you can continue on. Once you've completed these steps, killing the zombies off, you head back to where the golden circle was and you'll have your subway locker key. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and set up for the next video. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe and uh, hit that like button if this was helpful for you. I'll catch you on the next clip.